So I found an old western town in Bloxburg, so I decided to check it out. A little horse pen, a little, oh, 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 Sheriff Dwayne Benson. This guy must be the owner of this place. Little did I know that the sheriff who owned and ran this place had creepy plans for whoever visited. Make sure you never tell anyone about this because no one in the modern age knows why this old western town is abandoned. But the sheriff did something to me that will shock you. So make sure you watch until the end. Yeah, it's a pretty nice cell, dude. Like, I mean, I, it's, a, it's a prison cell. I mean, obviously, why am I not guessing? Why, why am I not guessing? Oh my. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Bloxburg video. Hopefully you guys are all having a great day so far. I'm not gonna go by myself. I gotta say, I'm super excited for this Bloxburg episode because I was actually wandering around and there's an old Western town right over here. I've never seen an old Western town before in Bloxburg. Before we get into that, I do wanna say, if you guys wanna use code ANT when you buy Robux, feel free to do so. The link is in the description, but use code ANT when you buy your Robux. And I appreciate you guys and I love you guys. But anyways, I wanna go check out this old Western town here because there's literally a saloon. It looks like, oh, there's a jail what the heck there's so much stuff over here wait a minute hold on what's going on over here there's literally an old western town here this is so sick they got like a, a little horse pen a little oh 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 sheriff Dwayne benson this guy must be the owner of this place he said hey sir i would say hi sir how are you uh, i'm gonna say nice place you have here you guys got a nice place he said welcome to the wild wild west oh wow i literally feel like i'm in the wild west right now it's like a small little town looking good looking cool um okay i kind of just want to look around i wonder if this guy will give me a tour or anything but it looks like there's there's an office, a jail, and the saloon, and a couple other things. He said, would you like a tour of the place? Uh, sure, sure. I definitely would love a tour of the place, to be honest with you. I've, uh, I've never seen a town like this in Bloxburg before. Okay, he said, this is Bloxburg's oldest western town. Okay, oh, wow. Oh, wow. I'm saying, oh, wow. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool indeed, my friend. All right, well, looks like he's bringing me to the saloon. This is kind of cool, not gonna lie. He said, come into the saloon. Okay, well, it's very nice to meet you. I'm gonna say, it's nice meeting you, sir. Thank you for the tour. I gotta, I gotta be nice. I gotta be nice. Okay. Okay, he said, come to the saloon. Okay, so I'm sitting down at the saloon. This place is pretty nice. Gotta say, it's pretty cool so far. So good. Nothing nothing weird about this place, although it could be weird. I don't know. Every time I, I see some weird place like this, some weird stuff goes out. He says, this town hasn't had any people living in it since dot, 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 never mind. Wait, what? No one lives here? He said, would you like a drink? Uh, sure. I would love a drink, actually. I mean, hey, we're at the saloon. Might as well uh, have a nice little drink. You know what I'm saying? Okay, um, yeah, he, he, he didn't tell me exactly. He said, no, no one has since dot, dot, never mind. Why does he keep saying never mind? mind. What do you mean never mind? This guy's acting weird, man. I don't even, like, what the heck? Why would he say, like, since? And then he just wouldn't tell me the time frame. That's kind of weird. Kind of weird. Okay, so he said, we'll leave it for later. Uh, later, question mark? Okay, where did he go? He went some. Where did he go? Oh, he's, he's jumping out. He said, let's keep walking. Okay, interesting. Um, well, it looks like he definitely chugged some hot sauce because his head was on fire for a second, but alright, well, he's gonna continue the tour. It's a cool looking place, I gotta say. Um, looks like this might be some horse stalls or something. He said, here are the stables. Uh, nice. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna say nice. Where are the horses? This is for your trusty old stallion. Okay, he said in the chat there aren't any horses here since no one lives here since dot dot. Why does he keep saying? Wait, I'm gonna say since when? Question mark. Why won't you tell me? Okay, this is kind of weird. Not gonna lie. He said come back here. We can talk about it or we can't talk about it in public. Okay, so I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna sit down right here at the bar here. I don't know what he's saying, but he's acting kind of weird. Not gonna lie, man. I don't know what's going on here, but he's definitely, uh, he's, he's got something weird about him, man. I don't know what he's talking about. I'm gonna say, okay, so what you gotta say? He's typing. He's definitely typing. I don't know. He said, I'll have to tell you about the secret that happened back in the day. Um, okay. All right. I'm interested in hearing it. I don't know what this guy, he's, he's acting weird. He's like, the guy want a tour, but hey, uh, there's a secret, but uh, we can't actually tell you about it. He said, we'll get to that at the end of the tour. Okay, then why did you bring me in here? He, he just, he was like, we can't talk about it in public, but he won't tell me now. <laughs> Like what? Sheriff Dwayne Benzie said, the public can't know about it. Okay, fine. Let's continue the tour, maybe? I don't I don't know. He said, there's a reason no one lives in the old western town or in this western town. Okay, cool. All right. I guess uh, I guess he doesn't want to tell me right now. I don't really know exactly what to think about this, but all right. So he said, let's continue the tour. Okay, so we made it out here. He's bringing me to the old, these old buildings. This looks like a house of some sort. There's a railroad track here. I don't know. Let's check out the inside of this house. This looks like a, this looks pretty, pretty fine. It doesn't look like anybody doesn't live here. He said, this is the model of 
of one of the houses back then. Okay, okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, I guess. I guess. All right, he's giving me a nice little tour of this place. It's pretty cool. I don't have guests. Oh, I do have guests, so I can open up and stuff. All right, it looks like he's, uh, he trusts me with his town, which is nice. Nice little shower and stuff. I guess this is a model of what it looked like back in the day. He said, we tried to make it a bit more modern, uh, but we don't really know since the event. Wait, the event? The ev what is he talking about the event? I'm assuming that's what he's talking about before. Uh, he said the drama. I'm gonna say, why can't you tell me about this now? Like, uh, he literally says that the public can't know about that. He said, save it for later. Okay, this guy's being weird, bro. Like, what the heck? I thought, like, an old western town would be, like, nice and welcoming and stuff, but he said, blank, save it for the end of the last building. Okay, well, he's, he's showing me a bunch of stuff. It looks pretty nice. I, I don't know. I'm kind of weirded out, though. This doesn't really seem right. He said, and finally, this is my office. Okay, so this is definitely the sheriff's office for sure. You could sit down in the chair. Okay, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, pretty nice. Pretty, pretty nice place. I mean, hey, this is a nice town. Pretty much all of the tour. Okay, well, all right. Well, uh, pretty nice. Pretty nice. I do, I do want to say. Pretty nice. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, I almost changed that decal on him. He said, let's go into the final building. Uh, I'm assuming is the last building the jail? Question mark? I, okay, I don't know what he's talking about. He's talking about some sort of last building. I'm assuming it's the jail that's right here. I mean, literally, that's the only other building in this entire place right here. Clearly, so. I don't know what he's on. He's not leaving. Okay, he said yes, but let's talk about it before we go in. Okay, all right. Sounds good, I guess. I, I don't really know what to think about this. It's kind of weird, but he clearly trusts me with the plot since I'm already guessed. So here it is. Okay, all right. I don't know what he's about to say right now, but this might be some crazy stuff. There's fans outside. They're wondering what the heck's going on, too. Let's be real here. I don't know what's exactly happening, but he uh, he said, back in 1847, there was a man named Tags. Okay, well, he, he, he got tagged. I guess we don't know the guy. Jerry? Oh, he keeps getting tagged. I feel bad for this guy. I swear, this happens every time I go into a random plot. They just get tagged like crazy. He said, Jerry Ben. <laughs> wait, Jerry Benson? Wait a minute. That's his last... Wait, wait, isn't that your last name? Question mark? Okay, I don't, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, people are like, don't trust him. People in the chat definitely think something's wrong. Okay, wait, wait, what the heck? Why does it, why do my stuff keep getting tagged? Isn't that your last name? Okay, he said, we aren't related, but I have a really weird connection to this place. Okay, so what did Jerry do? He said, so when he came into town, I don't know what he's about to say. This is kind of weird. He killed all of the residents. What? What the heck? Wait, wait, what? What do you mean? Question mark. I'm really confused what this guy's on about. He literally said, he said, Jerry, murder you. What the? Well, this guy clearly doesn't know what's going on either, but Sheriff Dwayne Benson, he said he committed many crimes in this town. Um, what kind of crimes other than murder? He said he killed everyone. Okay, well, I'm assuming he just did murder. I don't know what happened here, but this is weird, bro. This is weird. This doesn't make any sense. Um, he said he stole all of the town's gold. Okay, well, he, he stole the town's gold, killed everybody. Like, what the heck? This is so weird. He's a very notorious criminal. Did you guys catch him? Question mark? I don't know. I really just don't know what's going on. It's it's kind of kind of weird that this guy is telling me little details little by detail. He said the sheriff back then eventually caught him. Okay, well, he eventually caught him, but like, what what else happened? Like, this guy is, he's being weird, man. He's being, he's typing so slow. He said he locked him in the jail cell downstairs located in the jail. Okay, well, that makes sense. That makes sense exactly, but like, what happened to him afterwards? But that's when he then escaped two days later and hasn't been seen since. That's why I wanted to tell you the story before we walked in the jail. All right, well, this is kind of weird, not gonna lie. So this was back in 1847. So this is a long time ago, but this guy seems to be holding on to this thing that happened so long ago. I don't know why anybody doesn't live here. Like it's so, I mean, I guess it, I guess it's an old Western town, but he said, make sure you never tell anyone about this because no one in the modern age knows why this old Western town is abandoned. And no, what do you mean by no? I don't, I don't know, okay, I'm gonna say, I'm say, okay, I won't tell anyone. Okay, this guy's, this guy's kind of weird. He said no one lives here anymore. Um, why doesn't anyone live here though? I'm actually kind of confused because that was so long. I'm gonna say that was so long ago. Like it was literally so long ago. Like what the heck is he taught? Why is he so hung up on this thing? He said no one wants to live here where an entire town was murdered. But I thought the public didn't know. I thought the public didn't know. He was saying that the public didn't know. Like what the heck is he on about? Okay, this is weird, man. They don't know what happened to Jerry after. Um, um, well, that was back in 1847. Like, it was literally back in 1847. I don't know what this guy's talking about, but I don't know. He's really hung up on this old murder type thing, and I don't know what's going on with it. But anyway, he said, all right, let's check out the jail. I'm going to say, okay. Okay, let's check out the jail. Let's see what's going on here. Um, I don't really know what's going on, but he's bringing me to the jail right now. I guess this is where Jerry was. Um, so I don't really know exactly what he's about to say, but he's about to, he's about to give me some history facts right now. I don't know exactly what's going on. He said, this place is very creepy, and you need to be aware of the energy. Energy in here is quite different. 
Okay. All right. I'm just gonna say okay. I don't really know exactly what's going on. Um, people in the chat are saying he is working with Chemical U. Oh no! Wait, guys, have you heard about Chemical U? I don't think this is a Chemical U thing, but like, I don't know, man. I don't know. He might be. He said there has been many bandits in and out of these doors who served hard time. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, who stayed in these cells here? Who stayed in the? Oh, oh I literally just went to the toilet on accident. Apparently, you can teleport through walls, but he literally, he literally has said there's a lot of bandits who came in and out of these prison cells. So he said different criminals through the through the past. Okay. All right. Well, interesting. Uh, interesting. Where was he said, but we have to go to Jerry's cell. Whoa. I literally was about to type. Where was Jerry taken? He said, follow me. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm here. I'm literally here. I don't know what he's on about, but uh, he said this was, this was his right here. So this was Jerry's cell right here. Let me check. I'm not, I kind of want to check it out, but I don't know. I, I don't know. Should we go and check? I'm going to say, can I look inside question mark? I, I don't know what he's talking about, but he's saying that this was Jerry's cell. He said, go ahead. Okay. I'm going to go inside, check this out in here. Pretty cool looking cell. I do have to say yeah, that's a pretty nice cell dude like I mean I it's a, it's a prison cell I mean obviously why did he close it why, he close it? why am I not guessing oh my wait 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 what's going on wait why am I locked inside you're an idiot there Kringly you thought the one prisoner I could trap in decades aka you would escape from me I already let Jerry escape and I feel so guilty for that wait what that was back in 1847 what is this guy talking about he said that Jerry escaped from him how does this make any sense what wait what Guys, I don't know what's happening here. He said, I won't let history repeat itself. Wait, what? No, no, no. Where'd he go? Oh my God, he's gone. What the heck just happened? I literally just got locked inside of here. I literally don't know what just happened, but like, what the heck just... I don't even know what to think right now. I really don't even know what to think right now. I can't do anything. I, I'm, I'm not guessing anymore, so... I mean, I could teleport back, but like, what is going on, man? What is this all about? Alright guys, I don't know what the heck this guy just did, but he literally locked me in the cell down here. He was touring me of his beautiful old western town, and then he just locked me in. Like, he seems so hung up on, on this thing from the past, but it was so far in the past. How is this guy in the in the present if he was the one who locked him up? Unless he's lying about the actual year that this happened, but like, I don't know guys. How am I supposed to get out of here? There's nothing, there's no way at- Oh my god. There's a secret door in that other one. They're, they're literally... Oh, you can't see it from over here, but you can just barely see it right over there. There's no secret door in here, but like, dude, what the heck? I need to find a way to get out of here, guys. Oh, oh he's back. Uh, sir, sir, please let me out. I need water, please. I need water, please. So bad. Okay, I don't know what's going on right now, but like, he literally... He said, I can't let you escape, Kringly. What do you mean you can't let me escape, bro? I need to get out of here, bro. I need to get out of here so bad, bro. I need to knock on this door again, bro. He said, not like Jerry did, Um, but I did didn't do anything wrong. I literally didn't do anything wrong, and this guy is literally telling me that I, I, he's got to lock me up. Uh, that was not me. He said, or I will... Uh, okay, I'll get you some water. Okay, so he said he was gonna get me some water. Um, I don't know what's going on, guys. This is just so weird, man. This doesn't make any sense. Guys, hopefully he opens up the, the door. Oh, oh, he opened up the, he opened up the door. I'm gonna punch him. Bah! There we go. Yes! Oh my god, we punched him! Oh my god. What do I do? What do I do? I don't even have guest. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, sir, give me guest now! Let me out now. Okay, I know he said. Oh, he said. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, guys, we actually punched him. He said, "I'm so dizzy." Uh, yeah, that's what you get for locking me innocent up. Literally, he literally. I'm. So, he said, "I'm so dizzy." Well, yes. Oh, he gave me guess. He gave me guess. Oh, thank you, thank you. Now stop being evil. He said, "This is a flashback for me because the same thing happened to me with Jerry." I'm sorry. Just take the keys. Oh my God, he gave me the keys. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's open the door. We gotta open the secret passage. Oh yes, it was the secret passage. Thank goodness. All right, guys. I don't know if he's behind me. I don't know if he's behind me or not. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. I'm literally freaking out right now. Oh God, he's right here. What the heck? Oh, what the heck? What the heck happened to my head? I literally, I don't even, how did I, how did I get back in this cell? What the heck just, what even happened? I don't even remember anything. I just remember trying to escape and I don't remember anything before. Like, I, I remember things before, but I don't remember anything after, bro. My head hurts. Why am I in this cell? How do I, how am I going to get out of here, man?